congratulations mr akil uh, on thank you sir all india first rank with electrical engineering stream in engineering services 2022 briefly about yourself uh, sir i am akil kumawat i am from jaipur rajasthan i did my uh, engineering in uh, electrical engineering from uh, mnit jaipur and i am mm-hmm. uh, and i passed uh, and i am a pass out from uh, 2021 batch Very uh, good. before and uh, i started my preparation in 2020 and uh, currently i am working in indian oil uh, i was uh, I, yes sir which i joined by securing all india rank 62 in gate exam okay. you started your preparation in the third year of btec na no? third year it seems Ah uh, yes, sir. Third year, sixth semester. Okay. Yes, sixth semester. So, what was your preparation strategy as a college-going student? Sir, initially my aim was to complete uh, the course, and uh, from the very start, I was focused on both the exams, like uh, gate and engineering services. So, so, strategy was simple that uh, first I have to complete uh, the syllabus of both the exams, since I had a lot of time, almost around nine to ten months before the gate exam, twenty twenty one. Yes. So before that uh, uh, first i started uh, before that also like in 2019 i had started preparation so some of some part of my technical was already done and uh-huh. after that i switched to <clears throat> engineering services uh, in that non technical part which i took uh, which i completed uh, after 3 4 months and uh, then i shifted back to uh, the technical parts but uh, just before the 2021 gate exam i just uh, completed my syllabus so because of that uh, i couldn't do proper revision and uh, my rank was not that good in 2021 it was around uh, 1100 so after that i completed my btech uh, and uh, uh, after that i started preparing again for uh, the, there was prelims after two and a half months so uh, i was back on track and uh, i started uh, uh, doing more practicing uh, more practice and uh, giving lot of test series and all and then after that uh, i prepared i appeared in prelims and then mains and then gave the interview as well and in this process uh, that uh, preparation for uh, gate uh, actually helped me in uh, securing a good rank uh, this this year in engineering service also okay. and uh, basically both the exams uh, uh, they played a big role in each uh, in the other exams like gate helped me in engineering services prelims and uh, the engineering services mains helped me to achieve a good rank in gate okay so they were complimentary <laughs> to each other yes so actually when you came to know about engineering services and its importance uh, sir i came to know when i was in the first year of my college wow like before before joining the college i had known about the gate exam so yeah. yes sir so it was already in my mind that uh, i wanted to go into a psc or a other mm. government job so mm. uh, because of that uh, i chose to mnit jaipur because uh, uh, there is no better place than home for uh, doing your preparation when uh, your parents are also around with you had you so yeah from that uh, moment i i knew had you any yes, idea how to Uh, prepare a subject simultaneously for your university exam and for competitive exam suppose you have uh, say machines subject or power system subject while preparing for university have you extended it for gate and is psc also sir actually uh, there was covid in 2020 and uh, after that uh, <laughs> classes classes were online so i basically okay. utilized all the time especially in first 4 5 months for uh-huh. gate and engineering services so in that uh, in that period i completed i tried to complete my course so basically that helped me and uh, in the university exams uh, uh, al- along with it uh, when actually when the exams were there so before a week or peak of the exams uh, i was totally focused on uh, the university exams only for like two or three weeks i didn't didn't do anything or uh, on a gate or uh, engineering services because i already knew that uh, after two or three uh, two or three weeks when uh, the university exams are over uh, mm. yes sir so basically i utilized my time in covid and uh, uh university exams are a bit different because in that uh, you can easily score just by preparing a one or two night before of the actual exam 
but uh, this was a uh, different and uh, my i knew already that uh, i'll be having this much time before that exam and i'd already uh, done my syllabus uh, before uh, completing my engineering degree so after that all i had to do is just practice a lot can i say one line yes, majority sir. wasted their valuable time during covid i think you have invested your valuable time for competitions am i right yes sir once the covid started i uh, just after a week i started my preparation yeah you have utilized it very good i yes. think very few very few are like you anyway once again i congratulate you because time is very important uh, resource in our life excellent so anyway how our uh, a engineering academy helped you miss rakhi uh, sir basically i joined the uh, online test series courses of uh, gate and Excellent. and also the engineering services uh, gate uh, interview guidance also excellent see uh, so, okay you have attended our interview guidance program have it yes, helped sir. have it helped your uh, final interview the d day sir actually uh, all the interviews are very different like uh, when you give a coaching uh, mock interview and uh, when you actually appear for the upsc interview there is a lot difference like in the coaching uh, like in the coaching interviews mock interviews the pattern is a bit, pattern is set uh, but in the upsc they can ask like, they can ask anything like they can go from they can go out of the technical in non technical they can go into the current affairs and in technical also these uh, application based questions okay see how much it- Uh, uh, while the preparation so those were the few areas where uh, you need to focus uh, before the interview okay basically yes, the mock interviews are just uh, for just to get you into the into a comfort exposure. zone so that uh, yes yes sir, it's kind of an exposure so that you can do well in the actual interview akil how for how much time you are interviewed andaz approximate 20 minutes 20 minutes sir time sir it um, Yes, sir. Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. Okay. Uh, whether they asked any questions on general studies, current affairs, like that? No, sir. Almost ninety to ninety-five percent was on technical base, but in that also they asked the, the application base, the engineering based questions, like uh, which we usually don't uh, prepare, but we have to search by ourselves on YouTube or any other social media platform. Uh, can you give one or two examples on what applications? Can you? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Like uh, I know one question that in which I answered that uh, recently uh, a few months, few months back, Reliance uh, uh, bought a startup. It was named Faraday and something. Uh-huh. I don't remember exactly. So that uh, thing I knew when I utilized it into a particular question when they asked like right. the recent uh, ongoing things where which are going which are going on in the which are going related to the technical part. Excellent, Actually, excellent, Mr. Rakesh. Excellent, Mr. Rakesh. Really. I'm proud of you because you generally be in BTE people will go theoretically, so you extended your knowledge acquired to what is going on in the world also. What are your favorite subject in electrical engineering, sir? Last from last two three months I haven't studied anything, but in in the preparation time my favorite subjects were uh, machines, uh, uh, networks, and uh, power systems. Okay. Okay, okay, very good, Mr. Akil. Ah, uh, what is your suggestion to your juniors? Sir, to my juniors, I would like to say that uh, initially you keep, uh, you initially you keep working on your uh, to clearing your basics, and uh, they all should devote uh, some time on whichever exam they are preparing. And uh, even if they have time and they can think that uh, they think that uh, they can go. i was uh, i was telling about if anyone wants to go for both the exams then and if he or she feels that uh, he uh, that they can devote at least two or three years of time then uh, i would suggest that uh, they should go for both the exams otherwise one exam is also sufficient and uh, the key is that uh, from initially they should uh, focus on clearing the basics and once the basics are cleared like uh, overall the syllabus is covered then they should uh, try maintaining uh, the prop- try to uh, continue with proper revision and short notes are really important important questions are important like they should bookmark it when they are uh, attending any test series okay. and uh, <clears throat> and all i would say the uh, say is that uh, just practice because in the both the exams gate 2022 and uh, 
this engineering service is 2022 i have practiced a lot i studied very less but i have practiced a lot okay practice so that is, actually help practice is equally important compared to reading what do you want to say yes sir because in mains also i know that i attempted almost 15 to 20 papers mm. how uh, do you utilize this qca the question come answer booklet in mains exam Yes, sir. Sir, actually, uh, practice? Yes, sir. I actually practiced by taking the uh, original printout. Like if a yes, question sir. paper is given to me, then yes, I'll sir. I'll take the printout and uh, attempt it in uh, uh, three hours. Okay. Okay, Akil, I forgot to ask a question. What is the main difference between gate exam and engineering service exam with respect to type of questions? Sir, actually, uh, before that, uh, coming to the type of questions, I would like to say that gate exam is a one one day exam. Like if you okay. perform, if you perform well in that exam, then uh, uh, then it's it's uh, really good. Like you can go into the PSU or any other M uh, can also pursue for M Tech as well. But engineering oh. service actually require a lot of patience. Like first prelims will be done, then mains, then interview, and then also it's not uh, it uh, uh, after that also there is no guarantee that you will be selected. Like it's a, it's a long process. It takes a lot of time. So like which a, is easy in your opinion? Which is easy in your opinion? <laughs> sir, nothing is easy. But if you practice, <laughs> if you study well and practice, uh, practice, uh, practice, uh, a lot of practice is required. That that's all I would like to say. If okay. that uh, you are doing, then uh, every exam is not not easy. But yes, you can crack it. Yeah, really, really. Once again, I congratulate you, Mr. Akil Krumawar. Okay, uh, convey our pranams our best wishes to your parents. Thank you once again, uh, guiding our uh, juniors or our future students. Huh? Thank you. Thank you once again. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. Bye. Good night. Thank you, sir.